Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to turn off sensitive media on Twitter. So sensitive media might be activated for a couple of reasons, but when you first create an account, it will autom automatically block all sensitive media. So you won't be able to see any uh, tweets that may contain gore, uh, adult content, or anything of that nature. But if you want to be able to view that, then I'll show you guys exactly how to turn it off in this video today. So to turn off uh, sensitive media, you're going to have to... Is you can't find it anywhere in the Twitter app for some reason. Uh, they may edit sometime in the future, but as you can see, no matter where you go in the Twitter app, you cannot find the option to turn it off. You would think it would be in uh, security and uh, or privacy uh, options, privacy and safety, but as you can see, you can't find it anywhere in these options. They may add it in the future, so you might want to keep a lookout in those settings, but right now, the only way to do it is go to actually go to the Twitter website. So I'll show you guys exactly how to do it right now. So first head out of the Twitter app and head over to a web browser of your choosing. It can be a Safari or Chrome, it doesn't really matter. It can be a web browser uh, different though from those as well. But once you go to the web browser, search for twitter.com. So you can either put in the uh, direct website or just search for Twitter and then click on Twitter once it shows up. Uh, the address will be twitter.com. So just find that and once you find it, click on it. Once you click on it, it will bring you to the Twitter website. Here on the Twitter website, it might automatically prompt you to log in, but if it doesn't automatically prompt you to log in, then you're going to have to uh, click on the three dots in the top right corner, and then once you click on the three dots in the top right corner, it will ask you to log in as well. But just log in, and as you can see here, the option to log in. Once you find the option to log in, just log into your Twitter account that you want to turn off the op uh, sensitive media. So just log in with whatever your account is, either your email or Google or Apple. And since I have the email, I'm going to have to put in the password. And once you put in the password or log into your account, it will bring you to the Twitter homepage. So just log into your account. And once you log into your account, it will bring you to the Twitter homepage like I said before. On this Twitter homepage, you want to click on your profile picture in the top left corner of your screen. Once you click on the profile picture, it will bring up a couple of settings options. So let me click on it real quick. And as you can see, there's a couple options here. Here you want to look for the option at the bottom of the screen that says settings and support. And once you click on that, look for the option that says settings and privacy. Once you find the settings page, you're going to be brought to this account uh, page here. And from here, you're going to want to look for the option uh, to keep privacy and safety. Once you click on that, it will bring you to the privacy and safety page. And here you want to look for content you see. Here, look for the option that says display media that may contain uh, sensitive content. And once you find it, just check that box right there. Once you do that, look for search settings and make sure that it turn you turn off high se uh, con sensitive content. If you turn that off, you'll be able to search for sensitive content as well. There are a couple other options you can go through as well that don't show up on the Twitter app, on, but they show up on the Twitter website, so you might want to look through the other uh, settings options on the Twitter website as well. But that is how you turn off sensitive media. So I hope this video is helpful. If it was, I'd really appreciate a like and subscribe. Leave any questions you have in the comment section below. I'll do my best to answer them, and I'll see you guys next time.